Okay, so you're going to want to go to this website called GCT period Z I N T period C H. I'll have it linked in the description. This website was made by Psychonauter, Noki Doki, Sub39, and Milk. Shout out Milk, he's my buddy. Anyways, you can go ahead and choose the version of the game you have installed. It's just the name of this. It's usually the ROM. So for me, I have Japanese. It's 1.0 pretty much every time. You do not have 1.1. It's very rare. You want to choose 1.0. And then you want to select hacked file setup. Part of the presets. Make sure it's in GCT format. As you'll see that only FMV skips and enable exit area is enabled. It'll, if you hover over whatever code it is, it'll tell you how to use it and what it does. That's very useful. You can also set it up and you know, mess around with it. It's pretty self-explanatory. Like for the controller input display, you can change the position and the size, how transparent the background is. Yeah, go ahead and download this. Once you have this file here, you want to go ahead and plug in your hard drive or your SD card, whatever has Nintendo on it, as well as your game. Yeah, my game's here. Here, you want to make a folder on the root, on the very base of it, called codes. If there it does not, if there's not a folder that's there, then you want to just create one, name it codes, put it in here. You can do this with other games too as well. This is one for Super Dude Sunshine practice codes. Um, but yeah, there you go. And then make sure the game is labeled correctly. Here I have Super Mario Sunshine with the brackets GMSJ01 game.iso inside it. Now we want to come back to our Wii, go to our homebrew channel. I'm going to go ahead and open up Nintendo. And here I use my hard drive, so it's USB. It's like that. And you want to go to your game that you have in the Super Mario Sunshine J01. Press B on it. Make sure cheats are on. You can also, if you want, enable unlock read speed. That will um, make it so the loads are faster. It's pretty nice. All right, and now that we're on our new memory card here, what you want to do is just go ahead and select a file, and you have your practice codes on. So you can just press A to skip this cutscene. I have some timers enabled and stuff, so it'll look a little different. You just come over, get flood. And then instead of going and fighting the prana plant like you normally would, what you want to do is start, exit area, skip these cutscenes. And now you're in the plaza. All you do is just go save area since you have zero shines. It will save, and you've already watched those cutscenes, but you do not have any shines. So when you load into this area, it'll skip the cutscenes, but or it'll have the flag that you've watched the cutscenes, so they're skippable, but you have not collected the shine. So here's that file we just created. And as you can see, it goes in, and we can skip the cutscene. Boom, done. So that's how you make a hacked file on your memory card and also install practice codes. Hopefully it helped you. Thanks for watching.